So this is where. Excellent idea, Ordis. Tenno, we need to make contact with a corpus defector sympathetic to the Tenno cause. They will, of course, require compensation. You see what Ordis is referring to, operator? This is In the in game case, store. Compensation will not be credits. It will be freedom. I've updated navigation. You will need to break him out of a grenier. Oh, that just opens up the e shop. I don't need that right now. Okay, can I can I back out? Yeah, I'm not I'm not interested right now. But yeah, that's where you buy your stuff, I guess. From what I hear, you can play most of the game without getting like a ton of upgrades. Like, you'll give you enough credits to uh, to get some to get like one basic necessity. They always they they tell you they tell you uh, always get the extra warframe slot first, then everything else will fall into place. Like you don't have to pay money you, to get the most out of the game. You just have to play a little bit. Like that's what I heard. That's what I heard anyway. So. I mean, you know if it's if it's like predatory then you know if it's predatory then they'll be all over that shit, so but the game's being praised by the most of the internet, so you know it has to be alright. Okay. Our spaceship looks like a stingray. You don't notice that? It's a stingray. It's a ray that stings. Okay, I think we'll do one more. Yeah, we'll do this one more mission, and then uh, I'll see how I'll see how it is after that. Whether I want to keep playing for the session or not. Look at all the work that went into this. This is actually this is like really the polished. The is named Darvo. It is He's very polished. He's being held in the prison block on the other side of this factory complex. Like gameplay wise, graphics wise, everything's super polished. For a free game, it's pretty damn good. I have to admit. Oh. How many Grenier slaves died to build this place? The only thing I'm not too on about is the lore because I'm. I was throwing a lot of exposition without giving a lot of without giving a lot of uh, information. Darbo was out for himself, but he is sympathetic toward the Tenno. The Grenier must have found out. Viasaurus is working, breaking through. I see the shadows of your mind. Don't let Vor distract you. Focus on the mission. It's our only hope of figuring out this link with him. Yeah, like I was saying, uh, lore is okay, I guess. I just haven't gotten super into it because of the way it's presented. It could be better done to introduce me to this world and everything. I'm a little lost, but uh, I'm handling it fine. It feels very Halo, Halo-ish in the way it's telling me information through comms as I go, actually. I don't know why. It just... I just think of Halo. Alright, give me that, give me that. This is the prison block. If you can avoid detection by the warden, it may be easier to get Darbo out. Bypass the security so we can enter. Bypass security. Okay, they want us to stealth this section. Apparently. I don't think there's gonna be a like, super high amount of penalty if we get caught. It's just easier to do it this way. Mm. 
Search these cells for Darbo. He has to be here somewhere. All right. I owe you for this, Jim. I will give my entourage to meet us in orbit once we're clear of this mess. Extraction is ready. Remember, your success here depends on getting Darbo out of there alive. Oh, I can give him. I can give him a weapon. Hey, hold still. You want a weapon? The Lotus must be desperate to send you fetching greedy fools from the Corpus. We gotta go this way. Let me aside, Antino. I'll cover you. Uh, which end does the hurting come out? <laughs> I keep. I keep. Alright, I gave him. I gave it to him, right? Okay, here you go. Now you've been detected. Duly noted. Oh, I gave him my. I was wondering why I didn't have bullets. It's because I gave I gave him my gun. I see. You can go. Now the Ascaris has burrowed deep enough to give me influence. Shall we see how your shields work? Metal Gear Warframe Revengeance. <laughs> the Ascaris is letting Vor control your shield. We must figure out how to remove it. Avoid taking damage while I try and block him. Oh, we have like no health right now? I see. I see. <laughs> Alarms have been reset. Wow, he, he split that guy. Like, literally split him. Oops. That's death? Okay. Okay. That was fun. So, to summarize the plot so far, we are either robot or man in robot suit. Somebody slapped the thing on us that does that's like bad for us and we want to get it off. I see the operator can enable the mod segment now. Ordis will be delighted to show you how to upgrade your arsenal. May I recommend fire? Hmm. When you're in a, is this a blade and how do you order players? It's the blade and soul thing when you're in a soul campaign you know, player players are just no uh, upgrade your warframe now. Go to the arsenal to see the weapon upgrade options you have. Hmm. How does other how do other players come into this? Well, 
I'm pretty sure back in the map there, there was an option to wait for players, so these are story missions and stuff, but I'm assuming there'll be like later missions and stuff that lets you uh, do group group instances, and that's all you get out of that's when you do other players and stuff. Okay, so everything is in universe uh, in in universe menu. We call this a uh, digetic interface. Ordis patiently awaits compliance in using the new arsenal features. It is for the operators on good. Okay, what do we do? So let's say we want to use this one, Ordis for example. Ordis patiently awaits compliance in using the new arsenal features. Enhance the mod by it fusing for endo. The operators on good. Transmute. Sell and dissolve. Okay, so I'm assuming these are things that you can equip into you and you do stuff with it. Ordis patiently awaits compliance. Yeah, 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 I heard you. I heard you. Alright, so here are all the here are a bunch of other frames we can use. We can buy them, but apparently we should buy more slots first because we don't have a ton. Gear maybe? Ordis patiently awaits compliance in using the new arsenal features. It is for the operators on good. Equip a mod. By selecting it from the weapon and upgrading. Okay. So let's say you want to upgrade the stuff. Oh wait, no. Upgrade it. Now that's the appearance. That's the appearance. Upgrade it. An excellent find, operator. There are hundreds of these mods to locate. If my calculations are correct, there are exactly a lot of possibilities. Psst. Install the mod before we can continue. Okay, so it has to be this one, I assume, because we only have enough capacity for this. So yeah, it is for equipping. Uh, thanks for helping me out back there. I'm in your debt, and I often pay my debts. I recognize that device. It's a parasitic restraint. We corpus use something similar to keep our robotics in line. So. To settle my debt, I give you a very expensive blueprint. For free! Because I like you. <laughs> and well, a lot of my customers don't live long with these grenade dogs chewing up the system. Here, use your foundry to build a countermeasure device from this blueprint. Good luck. Metroid Prime. Yeah, Metroid Prime has a digetic interface as well. Vor's Ascaris is burrowing into your Warframe. I'm worried it will affect your mind. I can't lose you, Tenno. We must restore the ship's foundry immediately. A nearby ore extraction colony will have the foundry technology you need. I am certain they will share it with you. Its location has been added to your navigation console. Hmm. So I'm guessing this all there's all two sort of stuff we just to get this thing off us. You know what? I'll stick it out. I'll, I'll finish I'll finish up the tutorial, why not? Do we have a ton of stuff to do? I don't know. But we'll, we'll do one more at least, I guess. Yeah, we'll do one more. And then after that, we'll see how. Tenno, we may have a problem. The colony is unresponsive. Get to the surface so we can see what's going on. Okay, so let's see waiting for players. Oh, I think this is just a one-player mission, so... Oh, I th okay, I think we have another player here. Oh, there you go. If you want to do multiplayer, we just wait for more players, hit the plus button or something, and then we can go. The cinematic has two ships now. That's cool. I think instances are like up to four players or something. Okay. I was afraid of this. The Grenier are here, and I cannot find any signs of living colonists. You still have a job to do. Find the foundry segment. <laughs> Thank you. 
Hey there, buddy. Off he goes. This was once a prosperous independent colony until the Grinwheel arrived. So I'm guessing the because it's a tutorial mission, it, it's not that so tough. Their love will return when I deliver you to them. It's our mission, so. The signal will not be boosted any further. Hurry, we will run out of time. So it's a tutorial mission. I'm guessing that normally we want to like do cooperative stuff, but this one's easy, so I'm just going ahead of uh, going ahead from my fellow frame who is back there doing stuff. But yeah, now we know how the multiplayer works. I'm gonna choke this guy. You located the foundry segment. Now pick it up. I fell. Oops. They spotted you. Yeah, um, I, I'm. I know that. Get me up there. Uh, get me up. Get me up there. Uh, how do I get back up there? I'm trying to get back up there. Never mind. I'll find another way. Okay, there we go. I got super lost there. Good. Your ship is one step closer to completion. Now, there is one more thing you need to do. Eliminate all Grenier and provide justice for the colonists. I mean, all of them? Soon the worm will be in your spine, and I will control this war frame of yours. I will purge your doting mother and bring you home. He said it. He said the thing. He said the title. Alarms have been reset. Okay, where are we going? Over there. That thing is locked. Oh, that guy wants to do sniping, so I'll let him, I guess. Oh, we're good. Mostly. Neurotropic mass. Eliminate 30 enemies, I see, I see. That's it for this area. This guy's pretty good. <laughs> wow, look at that synchronized takedown.
Come out of the stairs, apparently. Alarms successfully hacked. The location is returning to normal security levels. Was a good as me. All right. Hey, we did it. Another job well executed. So that's how it's like to play with another player. I see. I see. Pretty cool. I can see this being fun if you have friends to play with. I mean, I can also see it becoming a lot harder, so yeah, it pretty much is very MMO-like, which is fine. I guess, it's because I never really see Warframe as being touted as an MMO, but it feels very MMO-ish. I mean, it's not truly ma massively multiplayer, but it is multiplayer. Instance, I guess. Your foundry segment is ready for installation, operator. Will, will the operator build a cephalon to replace me? Here is where we built stuff. Foundry restored. Here, the operator will craft many powerful weapons and tools to exact revenge for dismantling me. To expand your arsenal. Oh no. Operator, our component storage has been looted as well. Oh. Typical corpus. Sure, the blueprint is free, but jack up the components. Operator, we will need resources in order to build the countermeasure blueprint. Still not done yet, huh? Colonel, hmm. I just received a very explicit message from your ship, Cephalon. If you're looking for resources, why didn't you just say so? I know just the place, but I demand an apology. My mother is no gymnast, and she would never eat those things. You can go straight to... Operator, I am sorry. Wow. You may want to get a new ship, Cephalon, when you can afford it. <laughs> That one seems glitched. I've marked your navigation with a place I know. It's good for resources. If you can stand the cold. Hmm. Okay. I think I've got a general view of how this game is now. Um. I'm a little bit tired though. I don't think I feel like uh, going on a little bit further. I mean, it'd be nice. I think we're almost done in the tutorial, admittedly, but uh, I guess it's like uh, I think I have my fill for today, especially since I've already played a different game at the start for this session. So who knows? Maybe I'll get back to Warframe sometime. Maybe I'll do it on PC instead. It might be good. So, but yeah, I have fun with uh, I have fun with just my introduction. It's uh, I have fun with the introduction. It was uh. Definitely, I'm seeing the appeal of the game already. It's like fast-paced third-person action combat. It's very Devil May Cry-esque, actually. So... Yeah, and it's all free and everything. Pretty cool, I'd say.